And so we've begun to offer uh, teaching about um, the concept of the shaman. Uh, the basic uh, definition that we have of a shaman is one who acts as a bridge between the human and the divine consciousness. One who uh, understands and resonates with the vibration of humanity, but also has a connection uh, and an understanding of unconditional love of spirit. Uh, and, and in that, the power that comes to the individual for being responsible for their own relationship is without measure. It brings a beauty and a peace and a calm and a sense of focused purpose to the individual that is uh, priceless in any way that we know to measure it. So we are quite excited that the opening has come. It's a, we've been waiting for the balance to tip, so to speak, in terms of mass consciousness, realizing the old tool doesn't work anymore. I need a new way of thinking, a new tool to begin to open up. And we know others will be responding to this need as well. Uh, there's going to be a complete upliftment in terms of information that allows you to make the individual choices and to clean the, the emotional and mental debris, if you will, that are in the way of you claiming that relationship. Uh, for someone that has decades of being uh, within a religious organization that says, um, uh, you need me to access God, you need my rituals, you need my words, you need my book, you need my whatever, uh, it can be uh, scary to have a sense of stepping out alone uh, in a temporary own spirit, let alone with God. So the idea that these, uh, these tools and technique and information are offered uh, with the background of human tradition is really important. It gives a grounding to the human consciousness. Others have done this and, and had tremendous support and had great success and fulfillment in their lives doing this work. So perhaps now I too can find my way uh, into a deeper, more personally impactful, very meaningful day-to-day, moment-by-moment relationship with God, Goddess, all that is. Oh, thank you. And for my clarification, you seem to use shaman, uh, the term in a way that I might use practitioner or healer. Yes. There is a lot of um, confusion right now, and that's why whenever we begin teaching, we begin with definitions, because um, uh, you're, you're, you're gathering individuals from every, every background. Some come with a great understanding of what my church said, some come with an understanding of what my ancestor said, uh, and some come with this, I don't have a clue. <laughs> mm. And you meld them together, and so yes, practitioner, healer, um, herbalist, uh, traditionalist, uh, dancer, uh, musician, um, all of these and, and thousands more are simply faces of we're, what we're calling the new shaman energy. Oh, very good. That, that's helpful. Thank you.